Do not let it trouble you so much. Let's go in. As you can see, the rain is coming. Don't worry, Mama. I'm fine here. I have already accepted my fate long time ago as the son of no man. Are you the one that cultivated our land? The one on the road to the stream? Nande and the son came to want us to stay away from all the land. I didn't tell you because I don't want you to confront them. You don't want me to confront them. Uncle Onamdi wants to take what belongs to us. And you are saying you don't want me to confront them. Are you not scared of hunger? Son. The gods are kind. And they will provide for us. Let it go. I won't. My father showed me those lands before he died. He did that because he knew Uncle Unnamdi is wicked and will rise against us someday. Over my dead body will he take what rightfully belongs to me. What do you want to do? You cannot fight him. Because the elders will support him. I don't care who the elders support. I will fight with the last drop of my blood. In fact, I will warn him to stay away from those lands. Nana, don't. Nana, please. Please, please. Please, let it go. Please, my son. Please, let it go. Please. So this this man is sweet. It is sweet. It must be okay first man wine. Obo okay first man wine. In kabo Okorias on is the one. Okay, is it Okorias man wine? Listen. My mother told me how you came to our house and confronted her. Now listen and listen attentively. Never in your diabetic life will you insult or confront my mother again. Over my dead body will you take what rightfully belongs to me. Stay away from those lands. Else, what will fight you will be bigger than you. What did you just say? You heard me loud and clear. Stay away from those lands. Else, what will fight you will be bigger than you. And, and I go to die you soon. And who are you talking to in that manner? Ma Bugisi. Who are you talking to? I will bab you. Ah! Ma um, Bugisi. Eche. Eche, 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 my son. Eche. No! Eche. Eche, my son. Eche. Mm. Don't worry yourself. <laughs> Nana. Let me tell you a story about your life. In case your foster mother did not tell you. Where you were born, you came with a case. In fact, when you were born, you were dragged in, out of your mother's belly. And that is why, till date, you walk with a limp. Moreover, your mother gave birth to you through prostitution. And that is why nobody knows your father. I am surprised, baffled. I, Adako, was able to convince my late brother to bring you in out of nowhere. Bear in mind that a child born out of wedlock and without a father has no inheritance in the land. He is a son of no man. No man. Thanks for the insult, but I am not here for history. For the very last time, stay away from those lands. Else, I will discover your face. As for you, Mama, da! I will bat you. Da! Papa, uh, in case. Come, 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 come. Papa! Hey, 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 hey. No, 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 no,
no, no, no, no. No! Papa, I will not take this! From a man with one leg! Bro! Let me tell you the truth! That boy is evil, no. I warn all of you. Don't go near him. Yeah, okay, stop saying that. Uh -uh. Yeah. Okay. You think our strength, you can, can compare our strength with that of Eche. Eche will destroy him, massacre him and kill him. Forget it. My boy, you are strong. I know. Ah! Yes! A little, a little boy. Nkechi, my daughter. If it is another thing that is coming in between the two of you. But in this situation, there is no remedy. I'm afraid there is nothing I can do about it. Mama. I'm in love with Nana. I'm in love with him. Please, Mama. I love him with all my heart, all my being. I don't know why this is happening to us. Mama, why is this? Why is it happening to us? No one, no one is without a father. No one. I can't tell why, why they give him such, such hopeless status. But Mama, 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 please, Nemo, Nemo, Nico, Nico, please, something has to be done. Mama, something has to be done about this. Please, Mama, please, Mama, please, please. I love you. Hey! You told me Melalo. Eh? Me Melalo. Hey! Mama, I am so sorry. Please forgive me. I do not know how I got into this. But I never knew I could end up getting this hot. <laughs> now my heart bleeds from the guilt I feel. <laughs> hey, how will you know? Hey, Jama, tell me, how will you know? When you were busy, my God, pium, 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 pium. Can't you see that what you did is despicable? I know, Mama. I know. I knew my action was sinful. <laughs> I have condemned myself enough that I cannot start someone else condemning me. Please tell me what to do. What should I do okay. to leave this okay. body? Is everything okay? Okay. It's my princess. Do you remember that hunter that gave us bush meat the other day we went out with my brother? Oh, the one that said his name is Nana. Oh yes, you remind me of his name. My princess, what about him? <sighs> okay. You know you're the closest person to me. I'm one of my princess and I'm not going to hide anything from you. Okay, my, I have been thinking about him, and I think he's handsome. Yes, he is, my princess. I think I am in love with him. My princess, I think you need to find out if he has the same feelings for you. Before expressing yourself to him, don't you think so? I think you're right. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. We need to see him again. Yes, we need to. Okay, can now Thank go. you, my princess. No, not until you prove to me that you love me. 
Oh, come on, Amara. I have proved that to you over a thousand times. Mm -mm. Okay? I love you, Amara. I love you. No. Say, I love you, my queen. <laughs> say it. All right. I... I love you, my queen. <clears throat> Say it again. I love you, my queen. And I will always love you. Then prove it. All right. Be really out of your mind. Keep on dreaming. Ah, dreamer. I can. <laughs> yes! <laughs> that is good, though. The princess deserves to be loved. If the man in question is good, she will be happy. My dear, she has already fallen in love with the man. I have no doubt the man is going to reciprocate her love for her. I mean, who wouldn't find himself lucky to be loved by a beautiful princess? You are very correct. I agree with you. But, but I'm yet to know who the man is. Because love, they say, is a tyrant that spares no one. Yes. And I'm, I've never seen her falling for anyone before. Okay, this man you were talking about must be a very unique person. Mm. He is. You need to see him. I'm happy for my princess. I'm, I'm happy for her too. <laughs> so, so what is the gist? <laughs> gist me on a shaky. On a shaky. On a shaky. <laughs> <laughs> Amara, we were actually talking about you. We were just... Imagining how you managed to get the prince's attention. So you know. Oh my goodness. You know, eh, whenever the prince looks at me, there's this light in his eyes that turns my life around. And whenever he looks at me, I am so happy. <laughs> you know, you know, I told you. I told you. And it's, it, I am so happy. I know you're happy for me too. Yeah, you said it. And... Didn't you see the prince is reciprocating the love? Yes. So you noticed it? I, we all noticed it. Yes. I can't wait for him to propose to me. Mm. Because if he does, I will say, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> but of you will be lucky to be my mate of honor. <laughs> <laughs> I know. You like it, right? Chama, this is getting serious. Oh. <laughs> I hope that's not a statement of oh. jealousy. <laughs> Amara, how can you say such a thing? You of all people should know we are suddenly behind you. I know, and I am so happy. At least that stupid Adure will stop coming here. That girl is not shaking. Oh no, I shake now. I am the shakable shaker. <laughs> <laughs> On a shake! Hey! On a Ok, 
Kim, can we go home now? I'm not sure he's going to pass here again. My princess, just wait. I saw him coming this way. I'm sure he will pass here. Just wait a bit, please. Okay. Oh, look at him. He's finally here. Greetings, my princess. And greetings to you too. We meet again. Yes. How is your brother? My brother is fine, but I have been waiting here to meet you again. I hope all is well. Yes. I thought you'd be happy to see me. That's why I've been standing here to see when you will pass. Who wouldn't be happy to see the princess? I'm glad to see you. Do you tell that to all the maidens? I have not seen any maiden who deserves my love expression. Oh. You talk as if you knew I was waiting for you. And you sound so prepared. A man is always prepared for what he wishes for. And in essence, you're saying you wish to have me. You are the princess. Who wouldn't? Hmm. Please, can you take a walk with me and tell me more? And tell me how you want to have me. Hmm? Please. You can tell me about your likes and what you don't. Because I know. So. Hi, Princess. Greetings. Greetings to you, Adure. I'm sure you're going to our house to see my brother. He has been waiting for you. Yes, I'm going to see him. Greetings, Nana. Adure, how are you? I'm fine. I think we have walked about enough for today. I have to go back home now. Our stay was blissful. It was worth it. I hope to see you again tomorrow. I shall make out time. Thank you. You're welcome, my princess. Father will consider me as your ideal bride. Who will not consider you an ideal royal bride? You were born for this. My father will be very happy to meet you. Are you sure? Yes. Yes, I am sure. Oh, my prince. I brought, I brought food for you. Thank you, Amara. Thank you very much. Um, <clears throat> my prince, I want to dance for you. No, Amara, not now. As you can see, I am with my beautiful woman. I want to give her all the attention she deserves.
You're so benevolent with your words. Adore, my father will be waiting. Let us eat. So we don't keep him waiting. Okay? <laughs> Are you okay? Yes, my parents. Okay, um, let's go and see my father. Okay. <laughs> hmm. Amara, what is it? Why are you so sad? Simeon, can you imagine? Because of that stupid, useless adoring. The prince refused to give me attention. Can you imagine? Why? How? Okay. But is that why you're this angry? Why won't I be angry? Just give me two reasons why I should be happy. I took my foot to him. Do you know what he told me? He said, please excuse me. I'm with my beautiful woman. Who is the beautiful woman? Adore. And he refused to take my foot. Can you imagine? Because of Adore. I'm trying to even like figure it out. Can that girl shake? I'm not a shake now. No, but you know. Look at me. Does she shake more than me? Look at it now. Does she shake? Can she shake more than me? Can she? Can she? I'm not a shake now. <laughs> yeah, this is a shaking will not kill somebody in this palace. Hey! Are you laughing at me? No, sorry. Or keep shaking. Oh, I'm busy. Can I be lying to myself? On a shake now. But I'm shaking now. Good morning. Why, your ma? Naked? I'm fine. <laughs> Don't be in a hurry now. I just want to talk to you. How are you? What is it? You know what I discussed with you the other time. The other time? Yes. I can't remember. You can't remember? Okay, don't worry, my dear. I will refresh your memory. You know? I told you that you are beautiful. me. Eh? You figure now, Masim. I would like to marry you. And what did I tell you when you told me that? Don't worry, I remember what you told me. Eh? Eh? And I told you to think more about it. Yes. Think about it. There's nothing to think about it here. I can't marry you. There's no reason to think about it. But why? In Ajun, why? What can I why? It's a Kagono. You're old. I still working. As you know, I have four wives. My younger wife, she's still younger than you. What are you saying? Go ask her. If you met her again, you got to be here. I'm dry, go, Pico, and I'm about to be here. Good morning, Mama. I do. I do. I do. I came to see you, Nana. I do. Nana. Just come on. This one you came to see me, I hope all is well. All is well. Are you not happy to see me? I'm happy to see you just that you've not visited before. 
Yes, I'm just bored at home, so I decided to come and see you. You're welcome. What Thank do I you. offer you? Nothing. Uh, you did not go for hunting today. No. I will go and set my traps later against tomorrow. Okay. How is Ugeza? Ugeza is fine. How is Adeze? Adeze is fine the last time I saw her. I... I was surprised to see both of you. Same here. How? I'm surprised the princess has interest in me. But I know it won't work because of my status as the son of a man. <coughs> she came to you. Is that what you're saying? Yes. Do you, do you love do you love her? Who wouldn't love the princess? I know she has interest in me. But it won't work because of my status as the son of no man. Yeah, you surely have interest in her. I do, Ray. Why are you being too curious? Is that something you're not telling me? No! No. I'm sorry if I made you feel... If I'm curious about my questions. Maybe I'll allow you to finish up. This is an abomination. How could such a thing happen and you're just letting me know of it? Huh? What do you take me for? Papa, I am asking you. My son, take it easy. Even yeah. you, it's your bala. So you mean that son of no man harassed the both of you and you did not find it needful to tell me? My son, this thing happened a long time ago. No? Because... Don't call me your son. Uh, uh, because you did not see me as one. Even if it happened a long time ago, you should have told me! Hey, but when... The last time I had a confrontation with him, did I not tell you? Yes! And I confronted him and I gave him serious warning. Oh yeah, Kavu? You did? I you am mean? not only going to do that. But this time around, I will put serious fear in his head so that next time he sees an elder, he'll be respectful and humble. Chelo, Chelo. You mean you confronted Nana? Yes! Papa, what is so surprising about it? Even the color of a chameleon is for survival, not for beauty. Papa, are you downgrading me? Mm -hmm. Eh? Yeah. Hey, hey, where, where, where you confronted him? Uh -huh. hey, what did he say? Yes. I mean, what did he do? Yes. Nothing. Uh -huh. What could he say? Uh -huh. What would he do? Uh -huh. He couldn't say Pim. He was so afraid. Uh -huh. Oh my God, I do. Do you mean you want to go and confront him again? Yes! And I will not only confront him, but this time I will remind him of his place in this land. He does not belong in this land. And it's high time someone reminded him of that. I will show him that even the colors of a chameleon are for survivors and not for beauty. Hey, 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 hey,
Onaga? Let's go and see. Eh? But they are Where is he? Nana! Nana! Nana, come out and face me like a man! Where is he? Woman, where is your son? Abum, what is it? Stop answering me with question! Where is your son? I demand to know where he is. Now! Your son forgot he has no place in this land and he goes about constituting this. What has come of I will deal with what him today. Useless. You mean Nana did this to you? This is unbelievable. I did not even know how it happened. Huh? It just happened like that. But don't worry. He will have me to contend with. I will deal with him personally. Imonyambo. It is high time we cast him out of our land. Yes. I totally agree with you. We have to cast him out of our land. Don't worry. Nana will regret his action. You know me. Ah! Can't believe he did this to you. Ah! What? How can a man do this to his fellow man? This is brutal! That nana, that boy is a beast. He's not just a beast. Nana is a fool. Mana, I, I want my son. I want him. But he was bragging that he is. Hey, he was confident, no. I didn't know he was going to treat him. Like Look at him now. Nana! Nana thinks he has won. Mba. Hmm? He who fights and runs away will live to fight another day. Mm -hmm. This fight will now continue. And if they beat me another day, what happens? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Let's go. Go and treat your son. Your Highness, he needs some fresh air. He may recover.
the strange ailment keeps me occurring. And, and each time it seems unbearable to me. Ugeze is my only brother and the heir apparent to the throne. I don't know why the gods of our land will allow such infirmity to befall my brother. I don't know why. <laughs> The maiden with you is the Igwe's daughter. Who is the maiden that left earlier today? Adure. She is well. You must not have anything to do with the Igwe's daughter. Yes. The one you call Adure is better for you. Adure is in love with the prince. Then what plans do you have with Igwe's daughter? I am the son of no man. I can't have the princess, even if I want. I know she loves me, but her love for me will hold no water. You don't have to always call yourself that. You don't! But that's who I am, the son of no man. He told me my father denied me and rejected my mother even before I was born. For that reason, I prefer to call myself that. I am the son of no man. There is no one born without a man. It makes no difference. It makes no difference. It's, there is none. There is no one. Come down, there is none. It's okay. That young man that came to visit to Geze on his sick bed. Oh, his name is Nana. He's a hunter. He's the one that gave us the meat we came home with some time ago. Oh. And he has been so generous to us. Oh, 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 oh. The new friend he told us he met in the village? Yes, Mama. Okay. My princess. Mama. <laughs> I noticed the way you were drawing yourself closer and closer to the boy. Is there anything you are not telling me? Talk to me, my daughter. You know, we don't keep any secret from each other. Mama, your observations are true. He's the man after my heart. 
And I've not stopped thinking about him ever since I laid my eyes on him. <sighs> Has he made his intention known to you? Not yet, Mama. And I'm very sure he likes me and he wants to be with me. I think he's a good man. But my daughter, please, you have to be very, very careful. You know you are the princess. Because I wouldn't want you to make any mistake while choosing your husband. Mama, <laughs> I know he's good enough for me. Can't you see how happy he has made me? I am happy for you, my daughter. Thank you. Let me see your brother. You sent for me? Yes. Sit down. Um, your mother has told me about a young man your heart is yearning for. Is it so? Yes, Papa. That is a great development. It is good that at a point in every human life, man or woman, he falls or she falls in love and finds one who would love him or her. I am glad as you are aging, I mean the way you are aging to maturity, <laughs> Papa, I know you have something to tell me. Just say it. Yes, my daughter. It is only a fool who hears it is six and just chunks it into his pocket. When I heard of this, I made some investigations. As a good father, or mother can do. And in my findings, I discovered that that man is not one you can mingle with. You can't be with him. Why, Papa? At least I need an explanation. Yes, daughter, I owe you that. I owe you that. You see, my daughter, it is not as if I am not in support of your happiness. But you see, that man in question is a son of no man, son of nobody. Nobody knows his family background. He was picked and raised by that woman he lives with who he calls mother. No one knows who his father is or whether he is an Osu. Tufia Kwanam, Nana can no be an Osu. Oh yes, Nana cannot be an Osu. But who is his father? Who? Look, I will be the last, even as a king, 
to give her to the hand of my own daughter in marriage to someone whose family background is not known by anyone. Never. See, daughter, it is not as if I don't, I don't know how you feel. I know your feeling. But, respect for your royal background should be paramount in your consideration. Over the years, we have been very unfortunate. The gods have never been so kind to us. What brought us your brother's health has been a threat to this throne. The throne that has been in our lineage for generations. I am thinking that you should share in the grave the family had been passing through than creating another one. Good. Good. Now you may go. The son of no man. The son of no man. What is it? You look excited. What is it? I got the news from the palace that Ugeze is well and only fit. Are you serious? Yes. May the gods be praised. <laughs> Let's go and see him. May the gods be praised. Let's go and see him. Okay. Let's go. Your Highness, he is now well. I am happy you are back on your feet. Thanks to the gods. My friend, it's so kind of you to come and visit me. Thank you. May the gods of our land bless you. Say, I promise to get a bushment so we can celebrate your recovery. My friend, that will be appreciated. Thank you, my friend. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank I you for coming to see me. Thank you for coming to see me. I can no longer be with you. It is my greatest wish to spend the rest of my life with you. I, I, feel, I feel so bad that now it's not going to be possible. You do not have to cry, my princess. But my heart bleeds. I love you so, so much, Nana. I love you from the deepest part of my heart. But you can't disobey your father. He means well. 
for you. I know, but I'm nothing without you, Nana. I am nothing. Can I ask you for one favor? Go ahead. Can you please close your eyes? Please. Why was the princess crying? Her father told her she can't get married to the son of Noma. No, you don't have to. I was 19 years old when Papa Nuku died. And he made me promise him that I will never at any point in time question or fight you about who my father is. That promise I will keep for the rest of my life. It's my burden. Let me carry it. I am sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry. So I am sorry. I am so sorry. Don't you too. You don't. It's not your fault. Are you regretting? Why you picked me up as a toddler? No! Never! I can't regret doing that! I can't! And I won't ever regret doing it! I am sorry! No! Do not tell me sorry! It's not your fault! I blame the man that denied and rejected me even before I was born. It's not your fault. Whether he's dead or alive, I don't need his apology anymore. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. The princess has not been happy and it gives me concern. But why can't she be with him? Why? I do not know exactly. Perhaps. A father thinks he does not deserve her. Well, it is true, I believe. Because not everybody deserves royalty. Yes, it's not easy now. It's not now. <laughs> I am so happy because that stupid, useless Adri will not smell the palace. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you bring the prince into this discussion? Uh -uh. But it's the same thing now. It's the same thing. What is good for the goose is equally good for the gender. You see that Adore, she will not come here at all. <laughs> Amara, and who deserves the prince? Of course you know it is me. Even the gods have approved it. You know. Please, Amara, Biko, don't even start. You hear? Don't even start. You must know that it's not always about you. We are talking about something very important here. Must you bring your best less affection for the prince in this matter? Did you just call me affection business? No, no. You just called my affection business. <laughs> I can see you are jealous. Yes. <laughs> Wait. Amara, jealous what? of who? Me. 
because you know I love the prince and the feeling is mutual. Both of you are jealous because you cannot shake. I can't shake. Jealous people. <laughs> Amara. What? <laughs> You're just a dream. You know what? You're mainly building castles in the air. Please, there. Now watch my dream come true. I just want to know, is it, did, did you reject my proposal because of that boy? Because of that son of no man, Nana, who can't even offer you anything? <laughs> Wait, Cherogodi, Ichie, is that why you're telling me, run the village, just to monitor who and who I'm going out with? Eh? I'm not telling you. Hey, Ichie, let me tell you, I wish. Nana had interest in me. I would have chosen over, over, Kenneko, hundred times better than you. Yes, than to consider you in my thoughts. Ichi na wagel for the last time. Stop following me around. Biko. You must be out of your mind to talk to me like that. What's wrong with you? Uh -uh. Like you said, if actually I'm out of my mind. I would have considered you. But no, I'm not out of my mind. Stop telling me about this, so. I won't marry you, Ichi. In that logi, I won't marry you. Get out of my house. I said, come Stop playing me around, though. Ichi! Mama! Eh? Hey. Mama! Nana 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 Greetings, Mama. Greetings, my daughter. How are you? I'm fine, Mama. Um, I came to look for Nana. Um, he went for hunting. It's not long he left. Okay. I'll be going home now. Please tell him that I came looking for him. Okay, I will. I will. Um, wait a little. Please sit, my daughter. Um, sit down for a little conversation. I have a very personal question for you, my daughter. I'm listening, Mama. You're a friend to my son. Yes, Mama. Good. Do you love my son? Nana and I are just friends. And he knows I'm seeing someone, Mama. He told me so. I know. But I want you to answer me. Like I said, it's a personal question. Listen to your heart. I'll keep the secret between us. Nana. 
I love him so much that I wish he knew. But the truth is, my love for him is not important. Because we are not destined to be together. Love and destiny. Am I any problem? No, nothing. <laughs> nothing. I thank you so much for your sincerity. Yes, ma'am. Like I said, I'll keep this to myself. Okay? Your secret is safe with me. Okay, mama. I have to leave. It's okay, my daughter. Please tell him I came looking for him. I will. Love and destiny. Actually, I'm going to the farm to get something before I sighted you. What are you doing here? I'm resting. I know what happened between you and Adeze. It must have hurt you so much. I was expecting that beforehand. My status as the son of no man has brought me so much pain, sorrow and agony. If not for my mother, I would have left this land and go to somewhere very far where my status would hurt me no more. Well, truly life is unfair. But it is worth it if you could find something to live for. And if you truly value your mother so much, you can as well consider it a reason you breathe and forget your sorrows. How is Ugeze? Ugeze fares no better than any of us. He has been brooding and he gives me so much concern that I have suited for all means 
but it's not working. I feel his pain. Asking you, is that something you're not telling us? Something like what? What are you talking about? So you're even trying to hide it, right? Hide what? Pretender. So you mean you've been seeing Echos and all this while? The Mazin Namdi. You never bother to tell us. We your friends. So that is it. Oh, for your own interest, yes. I've been seeing him. But it's not what you think. Okay, so you're not even trying to deny it at all, Amaka. Deny what? I've been seeing that chair. Yes. So it's it's true. Hey. Hey? It's true. But we just started talking. Liar. Liar. I don't believe you. I don't believe you. I don't believe that you don't have anything to do with it. Look. I don't believe that you guys are just saying. Amaka, it is your life and your choice. Anyway, as far as it makes you happy, it's okay. Thank you a lot for that. Mm? It is my life and it is my choice. And it's also my etching. <laughs> Echem. Yes, I'm the only one at home. She went out before my friends came to me. See me. I hope you're not in a hurry. No, I came here to see you. I missed you. <laughs> oh, so. Hey. Amaka, we have to be on our way. Hey. No. Yes, yeah. so that you can um, have time to enjoy your yeah. good company. No problem, eh? Catch you, fool. <laughs> Thank you. The friends are here last. Ah, those gossip bears. How are you? You help me. I'm arranging firewood. <laughs> you have to help you. I'm arranging this firewood. <laughs> yes, babe. Ah. How are you and where are you going to? I'm good. I was actually on my way to your house. Really? Yeah, I am. Who is she? Her name is Adure. Is she a woman? <clears throat> you said you were on your way to my house. Yes. <laughs> I wanted to inform you that I'm about to get married. Mm -hmm. My marriage ceremony will be happening in the next half of the day. Are you serious? You're I'm getting dead. married? Yes. Congratulations. I wish you the best of luck. Thank you. Uh, no, please help me and inform Mama. Tell her I'll come and visit her later. I will. Mm. May the gods be with you. And you too.
났나? <laughs> Sister, this is huge. Hey, it's this one for us because I'm taking this one home. Yes, sister. <laughs> Are you serious? You know what? I'll go home before you to show it to Mama. <laughs> she can't wait. <laughs> oh, boom. This is big. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. No, no, thank you. Let's go. <laughs> this is big. <laughs> big, right? Yeah. <laughs> Why are you this sad? It's a lunch of Abu. It's here. It's your but your observation is true. Hey, it's written all over you. Look at your countenance. What's the problem? It's here. Is he not that son of no man? I think the elders of this land needs to do something and chase him out of our land. What has he done this time around? It's your bala. You should be asking me what he has not done. I think the elders of this land have forgotten their duties to safeguard this land from miscreants. But I want to assure you people that the more we allow that son of no man remain in this land, there are higher possibilities that he will rule us one day. My son, it seems like you are my thoughts. How do you know what I have in mind? Huh? I have a plan already. You know, they say a single bracelet does not jingle. Yes. Hmm? And then they buy that, you know, see? And you call my Madonna or Bauf. So let's put it together. It's here. Whatever plans we need to do have to be executed immediately. We need to chase him out of our land immediately. Anything to just get rid of him. Come, come, let me tell you something. Uh -huh. That boy has beaten more than he can chew. We have endured him enough in this land. But now that I have a plan, like the doctor say, you fall for me, I fall for you. Then it is play. We almost fall in line to make this plan work. Isha Pala, you do not have to worry about my own part. I support this cause. I will do everything within my power to make it a success. Yes, you are the son of your father. And you must know, your father is in full support of this plan. Hmm? Obum, hope you know what you should do as the youth leader. It's your Bala. Wood already touched by fire is not hard to set alight. Leave the rest to me. Onumane, soon you should know how bad I needed this plan to work. That is good. We don't have time. The time is now. Mr. Apala, you will allow me to finish my drink before acting on it. Come on, go on and finish your drink. Enjoy yourself. There's more drink, give you one more. Come on, go ahead. Son of no man. <laughs> ah. 